morning. So we are just on our way to the Mercadona again to get some groceries in. Um, yeah, we had a lovely evening last night. Yeah. Yeah, so I think we're going to do a bit of shopping. Then we're going to take a walk down to the harbour then. So we'll probably take you along with us. Yeah, it's uh, another lovely day. We've been really lucky, haven't we? Yeah, we've it's had been really good. sunshine every single day. It's day five now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, day five now. Uh, oh, um, I think we're going to get a bit of lunch as well in the coffee shop next to the Mercadona. So I'll just grab all of my dress. So yeah, that is the plan of the day. And then Joe's making his famous spaghetti bolognese. Spaghetti, spaghetti bolognese with chocolate in it. Yeah. It's Charlotte's favourite meal of all time. Yeah, it's the absolute best. So yeah, that is the crack of the day. So yeah, we'll see you guys at the harbour. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out just got killed by a moth. Yeah, he nearly fell down the stairs, didn't he? I know. The moths are like the evil of the world. I think I may have just broken it up. Yeah, I see absolutely no need in moths. Living in with us. <laughs> yeah, you really hate moths, don't you? Oh, I do. I just got this feeling that one day, one's gonna get like into my ears, go into my brain and just like eat away. How's your coffee? Yeah, it's a good deal. Yeah, so uh, probably the only thing that they need in Tenerife is Starbucks. And we actually should be going somewhere where... Oh no, there's not one in the Slime Mall, is there? No. It's in Santa Cruz. Yeah. Well, we will be going to Santa Cruz at some point on this holiday. So you will get at least one Starbucks this holiday. Yeah, so what was I saying? About how much you hate moths. Oh, yeah. And cockroaches. Oh, and blueberries. Those things, I, I just don't see the need in them existing in the world. Even though we saved the cockroach in Tenerife here once, yeah, didn't we? Yeah, well, the thing is, because it was being eaten by ants, oh, yeah. and I feel like that's, not, that's no way to go. <laughs> yeah, that is just not okay. Basically, I hate, I hate ants more than what I hate cockroaches. Okay. Yeah, luckily this time we haven't had so many ants in the apartment, but last time we were like infested with ants, weren't we? Yeah, and um, well, Joe can attest to this how much I hate ants, I hate them the passion. Yeah. They're just, they just take over your house, they like, <laughs> they'll get in your bed, <laughs> which is like, <laughs> that's like your sacred, like your sacred area. Like no, no one gets in my bed without permission. There was actually an ant walking on the uh, toilet roll the other day. I've got to tell you. Shut up! <laughs> Why didn't you tell me? I forgot. Oh. I I chewed it off anyway. Oh, I'm gonna have to check now every time because like you don't want to rub it I know, out, yeah. like oh. into your money. <laughs> Changes everything. Uh. <laughs> so, Joe's thing that he like hates is flying ants. Oh god, yeah, flying ants. Um, I mean, you're not a huge fan of spiders, are you? No, no, not at all. Uh, then again, who is? <laughs> well, I name, I name spiders. <laughs> like not the huge ones. Yeah. That could. 
I don't know, because these, I think I'd be alright with like a tarantula because it's just like a pet. Yeah. But like the ones which look like they could kill you in your sleep. Yeah. No, we have to like get rid of those. Yeah, I feel the same, like tarantulas, they look more like, they're like fluffy, isn't they? Yeah. So they, for some reason, the sight of a tarantula doesn't do anything to me, like I feel fine about it. Yeah. But yeah, it's like those gangly, insecty looking spiders. Yeah. That I, uh, but... I'm scared of. I, I don't mind the small spiders. I actually name them. You do, yeah. And you pretty much name them all, Bob. Yeah, although I've been getting better recently, haven't I? There's been a Gerard, Arthur. Yeah, you've had a... What, what do you have? A Bob, a Gerard. Do you remember Arthur? Arthur. Oh, yeah, I do, yeah. Was there, there was a Steve or something as well. Steve. <laughs> Good old Steve. <laughs> Anyway, I feel like we're getting like completely like off topic. <laughs> <laughs> we're just talking about books now. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action, what we can be. Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubts Christiana's Harbour now and it is absolutely stunning here um, so yeah, we have filmed a little bit on our walk here it's just the most peaceful gorgeous place in the world if anyone does come to Tenerife I would highly recommend having a walk on this harbour and get to see some crabs there's loads of crabs yeah it's literally just like the ocean we were talking about this the other day when we where it's like just looking out at the ocean is so like relaxing because it's yeah. like there's you can see the horizon and there's like nothing there like because we both grew up in like the inner city the, yeah seeing this is just like yeah I suppose completely different from what we're used to yeah like, and it's just we're like, quite city people so yeah this is just as the kids would say majestic <laughs> <laughs> Or do you just get in the shop then, Sha? Peach snaps. You've been looking for peach snaps everywhere, haven't you? Oh, yeah. I like a bit of peach snaps. Um, I like to say schnapps. <laughs> schnapps. Who is it that says that? Schnapps. On, so is it Big Bang Theme? Yeah. And she says, um, like, I like peppermint. I like the word schnapps. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, so just got back from the pool. Joe's just having a shower now, so I thought I'd have a little natter as I chill. Um, I am already in my uh, pajamas. <laughs> um, I was going to try and put something cute on, but then I thought, oh, do you know what? It's holiday. Why don't we just be comfy? Yeah, so I'm just chilling at the minute. I got some TV on. Uh, I think Big Bang's due to come on in a minute, which is like my favourite TV show of all time. 
And yeah, I've been pretty chilled at the moment. So yes, yeah, so I think when Joe comes out with the shower now, he'll probably start making tea. Now, I don't want people to think that I'm just like leaving all the cooking to him. He actually enjoys cooking. Um, I mean, I for one, I'm not very good at cooking. My uh, cooking skills are very, very limited. But Joe, like, genuinely loves cooking. That's like his thing. So, um, like, I think if I was to do the cooking most of the time, I think he would be pretty, like, not upset, but, like, he, he like, he just loves to cook, so I think he would feel a bit bereft. <laughs> this camera's, like, proper heavy. Um, yeah, so he's gonna make spaghetti bolognese, and, yeah, I think we'd probably just, like, chill outside in that balcony, and then... I don't know if I'm going to have an early night because I, I just feel absolutely shattered. I don't know if anyone else finds this, that when it's like really hot, you just feel tired all the time or you get tired like way more easy. I think probably coming from Wales, where it's never hot at all, suddenly coming into the heat, like I think today was about 28, 29 degrees. Um, in Celsius, I don't know what that equates to in Fahrenheit, but for... Us coming from Wales, that is like scorching. That's like sweltering weather. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna switch arms a second. So yeah, so I'm just feeling like knackered all the time, and that I could just nap, just like constant naps. Um, even though I did sleep really well last night, so there's no reason for it. But I suppose when on holiday, <laughs> you may as well uh, nap to your heart's content. But yeah, this holiday's been like just what I've needed. Yeah, I won't go into like too much detail, but I was feeling pretty stressed and uh, suffering with like anxiety, panic attacks, that kind of thing. Um, and it got like pretty bad recently. So I think being away is definitely just, yeah, it's been exactly what I've needed. Just having some time to myself, some time to like think and breathe and yeah, like I said earlier on in the day, the sea is like the most relaxing place for me. It's like my happy place. So yeah, so it's definitely been for the better coming here. Yeah, I'm feeling much more myself, much more chilled. Oh yeah, I did my nails yesterday. So yeah, I painted them white because I thought they'll go really nice with the tan. Um, I just put the shorties on because I didn't fancy having long nails this time. Um, yeah, the colour I think was... Yeah, it was a Rimmel one, like the 60 second to dry thin. Yeah, the uh, Rimmel 60 second super shine in 703 white hot love. Mm. <gasps> I've got bun on top of my head because I couldn't be bothered to wash my hair this evening and style it and everything. Um, who knows if I'll even fancy doing it tomorrow. Yeah, I'm missing my little baby so much. Like, I look, like I love being on holiday, obviously. I would be an absolute idiot if I didn't, but I miss my little furry bummels. <laughs> yeah, they're bummels, but they're my bummels, basically. Yeah, I miss their little mischievous ways, and I miss having cuddles with them. I don't know if anyone's interested, but these pajamas, nice little crotch up there. These pajamas were from ASOS. Um, I've forgotten the name of the brand. It was Chelsea something. Chelsea, Chelsea England, or I don't know. It's something to do with Chelsea, but they were from ASOS. They're very, very comfy and they're very cute. Got little spots. I don't know if you can see. Yeah. I can see. I don't know whether it's to do with the chlorine, sunscreen, who knows, but little spotties. I don't know. I might do my face mask tonight. Yeah, do a nice face mask and yeah, I'm not sure really. Yeah, we tend to like to sit out on the balcony when we're here in Tenerife rather than just like sitting in and watching TV because it just seems like when you've got that amazing view, you don't really want to waste it by sitting inside and just watching TV of an evening. You know, it's nice to do that sometimes, like when we had the movie night, and I think we probably will have another movie night as well. Um, 
because there was another film that I think he's got on his laptop, which is Prom Night. <laughs> now that is like a teen slasher horror thing, so it's n not Joe's cup of tea at all. But I figure we watch The Fifth Element, which is more his cup of tea. So now we can watch Prom Night, which is more my cup of tea. Oh, Joe got me a nice card as well for our anniversary. He's the best hubby. I have to say, I'm quite enjoying vlogging. And I'm hoping that everyone enjoys this and it's not just like, like what is this rambly nonsense? Yeah, I think I might continue doing these like vlogs when we get home. So yeah, maybe like weekly vlogs or something like that. But yeah, we've actually got quite a lot of footage so far. I mean, I've been talking for about 30 minutes right now. This will have to be edited down a lot, a lot, a lot. Yeah, saying that, I should probably just shut up now because otherwise Joe's gonna have like a hell of a amount of editing to do. So yeah, just thought I'd have a little, not a little chat. 